My hair is already really dry. I don't want her to get even more dry. I guess I'm most fearful about losing the texture that I have already. Hi, my name is Tylea and I'm getting a little copper curly hair transformation. Uh, my hair journey is kind of complicated. I played with a lot of hair styles and hair colors back in the day. I chopped all my hair off and started completely over from scratch and it was really, really short. So I'm letting her grow back and letting her do her thing. I chose copper because it's a pretty bold color. I'm feeling really like fiery energy for this last few months of the year and I need just some fiery energy to keep me going. My name is Esmeralda Meco and I am a curly hair specialist at Curls 101 in Beverly Hills. As in my family, in my mom's especially side of the family, they have really curly hair and I always was blow drying the hair, relaxing the hair and it was still frizzy. When you learn how to take care of curly hair, you're, you're accepting yourself more, you're a little bit more comfortable with your curls. Now in the society that we are, curls are definitely more accepted than it used to be so many years ago. Hello, gorgeous. Hi, Esmeralda. How Welcome are to you? Curls 101. I'm good. How are you? you? I'm so excited to have you here. I'm so excited to work in these beautiful curls you have. What are we doing today, gorgeous? So I think we're gonna do copper today. Oh, perfect. Copper is my favorite, especially for fall for this time of the year. So let's yes. play. Yes, let's do it. So today, uh, we're gonna start with her color first. We're going to do her highlights. We're gonna use a technique called pintura. Pintura is a hair coloring technique that it allows me to be very creative in terms of like I could paint curl by curl and still save the integrity of her hair as well. This type of process actually is going to last most likely four hours. So in Pintura technique, we do not use foils. We are going to use just simple paper and cotton in her hair and then we're gonna cover her with plastic so we could process her hair. After that, we're gonna rinse it, then we're gonna do the actual color. I'm doing the reverse double process is because I want to see a multi-dimensional copper color. That way, her curls are gonna stand out more. I've dyed my hair before. I've went ash blonde, purple, blue, red, like a deep dark red. I've pretty much tried everything except copper. I guess I'm most fearful about losing the texture that I have already. So I want to learn the steps that it takes to hydrate properly. We're going to cover her with a plastic just so the color could process. After that sits for 30 minutes, then we're going to do the styling process, which is the hydration process in the sink for the conditioner. Let's say you use a cashmere sweater. You don't put a cashmere sweater in hot water because it's going to shrink. So curly hair, if you put it in hot water, it's gonna shrink and dry even more. The main process of dehydration is done in the shower. When they're in the shower, they have to make sure that the conditioner is massaged properly with the water and it's hydrated properly so the cuticles could be shut down and could be filled up with moisture from the conditioner and the massaging process that you use in the shower. The hot water, especially on the very top of her head, it's the part that gets the driest. It, it strips away all the natural moisture and all the moisture that she actually probably has left on her hair. The cooler water shuts down the cuticles and it keeps it much better, much more shinier, much more healthier because the cuticles completely shut down. If you want to take the excess water that is left in your hair, I suggest you use a microfiber towel or a cotton t-shirt because it does not bring any frizz out and it just takes the amount of water that you need to take out without taking the moisture or any of the styling products that is into the hair. Open your eyes. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Look at her! Oh my god! Look how cute she is! I'm feeling so fiery, so confident, so fun. I, I'm so in love with it. I didn't expect it to be so quick. It seemed like the process was really, really easy and my hair lifted so easily and I'm just in love with the end result. It, she looks and feels so good, better than I ever expected. And I want you to feel your hair. Look how soft your hair feels with all that condition. Yes, it feels so good and I'm, 
I just love how like rich, I don't know if that's the word, the but it feels so rich. So how am I been maintaining this red? So this is gonna need a little bit of extra care from what you were doing before. You're gonna definitely stay away from too much hot water in the shower. You're gonna give yourself a conditioning treatment at least once a week. Okay, yes. And massage and hydrate your curls the way I taught you when we were styling your hair. <laughs> Tabitha, I love you. You are flourishing. You are thriving. You are winning. You're gorgeous. And I'm here to nourish and protect you.